plant needs, and climate change. We know that plants are important to our everyday life in many ways. Many of the clothes we wear and the food we eat to the furniture we sit on, even our pencils and papers are made of plants. Plants also have a very important role in our lives, including helping regulate the temperature of our planet, producing oxygen for us to breathe, and providing habitats for many different animals. We all have basic needs to survive, and plants have needs too. We can remember what a plant needs using the word lawns. That stands for light, air, water, nutrients, space. Like us, plants are affected by their environment. That means changing temperature, water level, and weather will impact how healthy they are. When a plant can't meet its needs, its health suffers. If it doesn't get the right amount of light, air, water, nutrients, or space, it won't grow well, and it will affect the other species that depend on it for food or shelter. Earlier, we learned about climate change. As temperatures and weather changes, and the planet warms, we may see changes to the way plants can meet their needs. Can you think of ways that climate change could affect how a plant can meet its needs? Let's investigate by looking again at what a plant needs to survive and how climate change can affect how a plant can meet these needs. The first thing a plant needs is light. Different plants need different amount of light. Think about how some plants like shade, others like full sunlight, and some a mix of the two. As the climate changes, some places will have more cloudy days and others more sunlight. This means that some plants will find it hard to grow where they always have. These plants may become harder to find and some might disappear altogether. The second thing a plant needs is air, both air temperature and air flow, like different levels of wind. As air temperature fluctuates, plants can feel stressed. With climate change, the air outside might be warmer, which means some plants will find it too hot and move to areas that are better suited for them. Some of these areas may have stronger winds and weather will be challenging for them to keep their roots and stems together. Plants already do a great job of keeping their soil and earth together during strong winds. But if the weather becomes too windy, they may not be able to do this well. Changing temperatures will have an effect on the types of crops farmers can grow. Different crops around the world grow in different air temperatures. Farmers might have to change what they grow if temperatures change in their area. W stands for water. Different plants need different amounts of water. Some plants, like in the rainforest, need lots of water, while others, such as those in the desert, survive with very little. Climate change will bring more extreme weather, such as very dry periods called droughts and times when there's too much rain or snow, causing floods. The fourth letter is N, which stands for nutrients. Plants need nutrients to help it grow, just like humans need vitamins. Not every type of soil is perfect for each plant. Plants may find it harder to find the right nutrients for them when the earth is warmer. Bacteria and other organisms below the soil produce a healthy balance of nutrients for a plant's roots to absorb. Heat is stored in the soil, so as the temperature rises, these bacteria and organisms are impacted too. The last need is space, the place where a plant grows. Good spaces for plants to grow may be harder to find. While wildfires are a natural way that the forest restores themselves, things like too many wildfires could make it hard for plants to regrow, together with the other plants they need to support them. This can mean the loss of a home for the insects and animals that rely on the plants for a healthy ecosystem. As more and more humans use more and more resources, 
we impact the climate and are changing it. As our climate changes, water, weather, and nutrients are constantly moving. As we know now, there are many different ways that climate change might affect plants by affecting how they meet their needs of light, air, water, nutrients, and space. Because plants are so important to our everyday lives and the health of the planet, we need plants to grow and thrive. So, how can we care for the environments that plants grow in? We have a responsibility to care for the plants around us. By learning more about how plants are affected by climate change and global warming, we can find solutions for them to live healthy lives in the future. How do you think the plants around you might be affected by climate change?